Hey guys, I have to start my homework soon, sadly. Um, but I thought I would waste some time before I got started. Um, and I came up with my own uh, name game. So if you guys are watching this, you can post your answers at the end or a video response if you can. Um, and yeah, I thought it was fun and needed something to do to put off doing my homework. So my first question I came up with is name a baby girl and a baby boy using your own first and middle initials. So I named my girl Violetta Lorraine and I used my own middle name just because I really plan to use that. And for the boy I put Victor Leonardo. And the next question I put what are your parents and siblings first and middle names? So my mom's name is Sandra Sue, and she just goes by Sue. And my dad's name is Keith Douglas, and I really hate his middle name. I don't know why I do not like the name Douglas or Doug. Um, Keith is all right, but not my favorite. So, and I have a sister named Emma Kay. I have a brother named Benjamin Harrison. And then I have another sister named Mikal Jolie. And a brother, Addison Liu, and another brother, Keaton Reese. Um, next question is, name twins using Spanish names with combos. And they can be boy, girl, 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 boy, boy, whatever you want. So I did boy, girl, and I named them Liliana Belen. And Belen means Bethlehem in Spanish. I think it's a really cute name. And then for the boy, I did Marcos Benjamin or Benjamin. So I thought those were cute. And I like that they had matching middle initials for twins. And the next question is, you have three boys and three girls. Name the girls' names all ending with L and the boys' names ending with R. So for the girls, I put Liesl, Soleil, and Hazel. And the boys, I named Keller, Tyler, and Alexander. Question five. Reverse your first and middle name. What do you think of it? So that would be, for me, Lorraine Virginia, and I don't really like it. I think it might just be because I'm so used to Virginia Lorraine, but I really prefer Lorraine as a middle name. And Lorraine, I have a theory about middle names that they have, um, especially Marie. There are very few names that are two syllables, and the emphasis falls on the second syllable. And Lorraine is one of them. So Marie and Lorraine fit really nicely as a middle name with many, many names. Um, so I really don't like the sound of them as first names very much. The next question is, name eight babies, all one-syllable names. And they can be whatever genders you want. So I did three girls and five boys, and the girls are... Day, Al, and Lux, and the boys are York, Reese, Jones, Finn, and March. Next question is, would you rather have all girls or all boys? And then, so after you pick that, you have to name ten of them in alphabetical order starting from any letter you want. So, like if you started at A, you'd have to do A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J. So I picked all girls. And I'm going to start with the letter D. So I have Day Evelyn, Elaine Alessandra, Flora Genevieve, Georgina Charlotte, Hannah Lorraine, Iris Brigida, Josephine Kay, Corinne Marigold, Liesl Serafina, and Miriam Violet. And that one took me a really long time to figure out my middle name combos to go with those. And I hate K names, so it was so hard for me to find a K name that I liked. Okay, the next one is create five alliterative name combos of any genders. So I made four girls and one boy. I made Jeremiah Jones, Liliana Lux, Georgina Genevieve, Violet Valentina, and Elsa Evelyn. And I think my favorite of those is probably... Georgina Genevieve. I'm really loving the name Georgina right now. The next one is find one boy's and one girl's name that you've never heard before. Like go on a baby name site or something and find one. What are they and what do you think of them? So I found 
um, Lario, which I think is really beautiful, and I love the meaning for it. It means God's lioness. So I think that's a great name meaning. And I'd never heard of that before. It's like Ariel with an L in front. And then for boys, I found Rigel, which rhymes with Nigel. And it is an Arabic name, and it means foot. So not as great of a meaning, but it's kind of a cool-sounding name, Rigel. I think it's really usable. People might mispronounce it the first time, but once you tell them it rhymes with Nigel, I think they would get it right. And then the last question I created was, name one boy and one girl using names that start and end with the same letter, and make sure you have like a combo so that you have first name starts and ends with the same letter, and the middle name starts and ends with the same letter. They don't have to be the same, but like the first and middle don't have to be the same. Yeah. So anyway, I created Liesl Antonella and Nolan Rockefeller. I think Rockefeller is a really cool name, but only as a middle name. I think it's a little too bold to be a first name, but I really like the name Nolan. So that is my questionnaire. If you guys could answer it, that'd be awesome. Or if you could just comment on my answers, what you think of them, what names you like or don't like that were in this video. Thanks again for watching. You guys have a great day.